Hallelujah. 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 Thank you, name. Thank you, Lord God. Thank you, Lord God. Yeah, if you have your Bible, you turn to the book of Luke chapter 1. Luke chapter 1. Word. Hallelujah. Luke yes. chapter 1. Give me verse number 26. Word. Amen. Hallelujah. Luke chapter 1. Give me verse number 26. When you get there, stand to your feet and signify by saying word. Word. Luke ain't hard to find. Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John. Amen. Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John. Amen, amen, amen. Hallelujah. And what did I read? It says, in the sixth month, the angel Gabriel was sent from God unto a city of Galilee named Nazareth. To a virgin espoused to a man whose name was Joseph of the house of David, and the virgin's name was Mary. And the angel came in under her and said, Hail, thou art highly favored. The Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. And when she saw him, she was troubled at his saying and cast in her mind what manner of salutation this should be. And the angel said unto her, Fear not, Mary, for thou hast found favor with God, Amen. and behold, thou shalt conceive in thy womb and bring forth a son, and shalt call his name Jesus. Amen. He shall be great. Yes. And shall be called the son of the highest. Yeah, and the Lord God shall give unto him the throne of his father David. Yeah. He shall reign over the house of Jacob forever. And of his kingdom there shall be no end. Yeah. Then said Mary unto the angel, how shall this be, seeing I know not a man? And the angel answered said unto her, the Holy Ghost yes, shall come upon thee, yes. and the power of the highest yes. shall overshadow thee. Therefore, also that holy thing which shall be born of thee shall be called the Son of God. Amen. And behold, thy cousin Elizabeth, mm -hmm. she hath also conceived a son in her old age. Yes. And this is the sixth month with her, who was called barren. For with God, nothing, nothing shall be nothing. impossible. Amen. And Mary said, Behold, the hand made of the Lord, be it unto me according to thy word. And the angel departed from her. Yes. Amen. Amen. You may be seated. We have a message today that is entitled, God Chose Mary. God Chose Mary. Amen. Let us pray. Father, we thank you, Father God, for your grace and your mercy. We thank you, Father God, for what you're doing, Father God, in our lives. And how, Father God, you are, are using us, Father God, as vessels. To carry from one place to another place, Father God, your anointing, your presence, your power, and your peace, oh God. And as we, Father God, go on these journeys, Father God, we ask, Father God, that our, that our, our, our ship is full. Because there's a lot of places, Father God, that you're sending us, and they're hungry, thirsty for your presence, your power, and your word. So, Father God, speak to us, Father God, today, and want our ears to hear and our hearts to receive. For it's in Jesus' name that we pray. Amen. 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 God chose Mary. Amen. And the first thing I, I think about when God chose Mary is that he could have chose somebody else. Why 
did he choose, man? Why? What was so, 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 so muchy much about Mary? Amen. Why? Why was it that God spent the time through the annals of history and get to the, the place of, of choosing anybody on the earth? Right. Chose her. God chose her. It wasn't man. Man that chose her didn't want her no more. Y'all hear me? Mm. Amen. We need to choose it up, up to man. Man change his mind about you. Amen. Amen. Yeah, what he wants like uh, that glow and, and your swag. Uh, why did you get up this morning? You don't want nothing to do with me. Y'all hear me? Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. Amen. See, when we do the choosing, when she choose you and, and your hair start falling out and your belly starts getting around. Oh. All of a sudden, everything changed. Mashed potatoes don't taste like they used to. Because <laughs> she ain't peeling potatoes no more. She getting the box out. <laughs> Y'all hear me? All that love she was putting into that macaroni and cheese. Now all of a sudden the macaroni and cheese ain't even burnt around the edges no more. <laughs> Y'all hear me? <laughs> Glory to God. She was washing clothes two or three times a week and now she's do good to wash clothes twice a month now. Oh, oh y'all don't hear me. Honey, where my shirt? I don't know. There was a time when she knew everything you had was. <laughs> now she can't even, oh my God, y'all don't hear me. Oh, Come on, y'all, y'all. We talking about God. Yeah. Shows Mary. Yeah. Oh, man. <laughs> yeah. Hallelujah. As we approach Christmas, like my son said, Christmas. <laughs> All right now. The day we celebrate the birth of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, I just wanted to thank each of you for walking in faith with us as we are about to close out this year. Or oh, some of y'all been faithful in 2017. Y'all. Come on, man. We, we walked this thing out. Oh, now we're getting toward the end of this thing. I want to thank you for walking with us, Amen. walking with each other. Amen? Amen. We had, we have had a most wonderful 2017, and, and God has truly blessed us all. And those of y'all that are just now showing up around here, I'm telling you, you are locked in and locked on. Amen. Right. You ain't got to worry about it. Those that, those that see, see, some of us see, see we, we, we lock in, but we don't lock on. Mm. Y'all hear me? Amen. And there's a little bit of air that gets in. It messes up the flow. Y'all hear me? Amen. Glory to God. It's like having your battery cable not all the way connected. Sometimes the car starts and sometimes it don't. Amen. All right now. You got to get in and you got to get in and stay in, baby. Amen. Through all the pressure, through all the trials, through all the tests, yeah. God will bring you through. Amen. Amen. Glory to God. Please understand that we all have been chosen by God for a specific purpose, and you are only breathing because God gave you breath and life. Amen. Hallelujah. And I want to say that for the mothers. Wait at me, mothers. With all the cool look at this oh holy shama second people ma who Jesus <clears throat> that I want to say to you mother that when you gave birth and that child or those children were brought into the earth through your womb to be a blessing to the earth God chose you just like he chose Mary and I want to thank my mother for giving me life. Amen. For allowing God to use her womb as an entry point to transport me into this earth realm. Amen. See, see, you, you all, you, we, I said, tell you, but what's I We don't understand that that, that, that birth canal in from, from the woman is the only way yes. 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 get a human into the earth. Amen. Wow. 
Y'all don't hear me? Jesus. It's the only legal way that God could get his son into the earth. Amen. He didn't just didn't come down from heaven and come on. showed up. No. Amen. He come through the womb yes. of a female. Amen. That's why you have to choose wisely. Mm -hmm. I'm telling y'all something. That's why you have to choose wisely. Amen. But who are you going to let get you pregnant? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You got to choose wisely. Me and who you plant your seed into. Because we all done, we all done went through them things. But we, you know, we, we done carried this child for nine months for this knucklehead. We didn't we we done put a seed into a knucklehead. Mm. <clears throat> now we got this child running around here who is missing most of what God had for them. Because right. 75, 80% of our homes are being run by single parents. Yeah, and the other half, the child don't get. Amen. I don't think my mother is, 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 is get me into this earth realm and seeing fit that we all were taught and trained in a specific manner fit to be used by God oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. for such a time as this. Amen. Now don't get it twisted about how you got here. Right. Amen. See, 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 Satan didn't use the the, the, the avenue of approaching how God got you in the earth. You say, well, well God, I, I ain't pleased with how you got me here. Yeah, mm. You got the unmitigated call to get mad at God because he used the way that you wouldn't have used. You had no control of that, no way. Amen. 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 Not even in me today. Amen. God had purpose in the whole matter. Amen. Whether you agree with it or not, what some meant for evil... Yes. God can use for your good. Yes, Remember that all things work together for our for what? Our good for those who what? Love the Lord and are called according to his purpose. Amen. We have to understand that 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 that, 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 that these are qualifiers mm -hmm. and disqualifiers. Some quality qualifies you, and some don't. Amen. Just get over to the areas where you can qualify. Amen. Stop saying, God, I, 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 I don't qualify. Well, get over where you do qualify. Amen. Amen. I don't like that when we stay over there, then you, you, you disqualify. But it don't matter. It's, it's, come on now. It, it, it puts me in the mind of when we was living in Los Angeles. You need to hear me today. That you can be, the bus stop is right here. You can be, you can be right here running for the bus. But if you ain't right there, he keep on going. He don't need to stop slow down. You got to be standing right there and he ain't stopping. Being on the spot qualifies you to get on that bus. Yes. Oh, Y'all hear me? And a whole lot of times we was on the bus stop waiting for the bus to get here and he stopped, opened up, up the door and his people all the way pushed up against the glass of the door. Mm -mm. The next bus ain't but for an hour and a half, two hours. You know what you got to do? Mm -hmm. Step up into that bus and squeeze on the, the door and you push it through. They, 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 they all move. Amen. Because that's how they got on there. Amen. Y'all hear me? Wow. You have to squeeze your way into the qualifying section Amen. of what God got for you. Stop looking at the crowd how about, oh, it's too crowded. Amen. Amen. I'm getting into the presence of the Lord. Y'all just say what you want to, do what you want to. You don't like me here? Step up, push somebody else because I'm pushing you. Amen. <laughs> That's the problem with, with, with the church. You scared to push somebody else because you don't want nobody pushing you. Oh. And a whole lot of times we don't get what we want because the person behind you ain't pushing you. 
Oh, Jesus. Come on now, Rev. Y'all hear me? Stop pushing me. Stop pushing me. Stop touching me. Y'all remember when we was kids? Stop touching me. Stop touching me. He's touching me. He's touching me. Amen. Stop touching me. Stop touching me. Stop touching me. We know it's hot. <laughs> Glory to God. Push your way into his presence. Push your way into his anointing. Push your way into the qualifying factors that you need. What God has, has determined that you should have. Amen. And stop trying to make God bless you when you ain't qualified. Amen. Hallelujah. Yep. Hallelujah. Go back to Luke 1 26. Y'all still here? Amen. It's getting good, ain't it? Amen. Oh, Lord. You're going to need a knife and fork today, baby. Amen. Spoon ain't going to get it. Amen. And nothing you can do with no steak with no spoon. Amen. Amen. Pick it up and bite it, you all. Glory to God. Look at verse 26. He says, And in what? The sixth, the sixth month. month. Now, what the, the sixth month is what trimester? Third. Third trimester? Second trimester? What, what's, what trimester is that? Second trimester? Amen, amen. So in the, in the what? Sixth. Sixth. In the what? Sixth. Second trimester. Amen. Woo! The angel Gabriel was sent from God. Who was in their second trimester? Elizabeth. Thank y'all. Pay attention what God is telling y'all. Because he, cause he sent y'all, he sent Gabriel to tell Mary, who was a virgin, that Elizabeth was in her what? Second, Second trimester, who was what? Barren. I've come to tell you that I just went talk to this old woman uh, six months ago and she's pregnant now. Yeah. Then you about to get pregnant. Yeah. And in the sixth month, the angel Gabriel was sent from God into a city of Galilee named Nazareth to a virgin espoused to a man whose name was Joseph of the house of David. And the virgin's name was Mary. And the angel came, what, in unto her and said, what, hell, thou art highly favored. The Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. God then looked all through the earth at all the women. Y'all hear me? And chose Mary. Girl, you have the favor. God, God is with you. God is with you. Glory to God. Now, now, listen, listen, listen to me. Oh, Jesus, it's going to get good, y'all. Mm. Mary was young, poor, and female. She met all the disqualifiers to the people of her day. She also met all of them for us today. If you're young, poor, and female in America today, boy, you are the scum of the earth to, to, to the powers that be. Amen. You somewhere pregnant, trying to get health care, prenatal care, amen, food stamps, you know, uh, what's, the, what's, the, what's the housing thing? Section 8. And that, that, now you young, pregnant, and poor, I don't care what color you eat. When you go in for that section eight, boy, they give you hell. Amen. Don't they? They want to know everything but your. I ain't gonna see. They want to know that too. They want to know that too. Amen. Yeah, they do. They do. They 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 just can't legally ask you. Right. Also, that would make her seem to be unusable. To God. But man looks at the outside. God looks at the heart. But this particular situation is deeper than that. Stay with me, y'all. Mary was of the house of David. 
And way back in the Garden of Eden, 4,000 years ago, God knew he was going to use Mary. But how many of us know that Mary didn't know that God had chose her? She didn't get no memo, she didn't get no text, she didn't get no email, she didn't get no Instagram, no Snapchat, none of that. No tweet. Nobody knocked on her door, left a sticky note, or none of that. It's one day, after blue, we don't know if she was washing clothes, working in the garden. We don't know. All we know is, fwing. He read it, friend, I. Where you come from? Right. From heaven. The Lord sent me to you, girl. You had it faith. Oh, hell. Oh, hell, Mary. Oh, oh, oh hell, girl. You've been highly favored of God. Jesus. What has God chose you to do way back a thousand years ago. Yeah. Amen. Truth. Uh -huh. Amen. Hallelujah. I better stay with me today. Right. Look at Luke 3. Honey, I, I'm going to need your glasses. Your second prayer, your third prayer, whatever you got over there. I want to let you read this. I ain't going to be able to see this without no glasses today. I don't know why. I didn't bring mine out to Amen. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Oh, Lord Jesus. <laughs> you got the bling bling. You got the bling bling. You're on camera. Tanya. Tanya, help, help, help your first lady. You're on camera. Hallelujah. I know I'm on camera, brother. <laughs> Hallelujah. <laughs> Luke uh, <laughs> 3 and 23. Is everybody there? Word. 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 Amen. And Jesus himself began to be about 30 years of age, being as was supposed the son of Joseph, which was the son of, of Heli, which was the son of Matthew, which was the son of Levi, which was the son of Melchi, which was the son of Jannah, which was the son of Joseph, which was the son of Matthias, which was the son of Amos, which was the son of Nahum, which was the son of Elsley, which was the son of Nagy, which was the son of Matthias, and which was the son of Matthias, which was the son of Simei, which was the son of Joseph, which was the son of Judah, which was the son of Joanna, which was the son of Risa, which was the son of Zerubbabel, which was the son of Seathiel, which was the son of Nerai, which was the son of Melchi, which was the son of Adai, which was the son of Kozam, which was the son of Elomandi, which was the son of Ur, which was the son of, of, of Jose, which was the son of Eleazar, which was the son of Joram, which was the son of Matthew, which was the son of Levi, which was the son of Simeon, which was the son of Judah, which was the son of Joseph, which was the son of Jonah, which was the son of Elohim, which was the son of Meliah, which was the son of Mininam, which was the son of Matthew, which was the son of Nathan, which was the son of David, which was the son of Jesse, which was the son of Obed, which was the son of Boaz, which was the son of Salmon, which was the son of Naasah, which was the son of Amasiah, Amadab, which was the son of Aram, which was the son of Ezra, which was the son of Pharaoh, which was the son of Judah, which was, which was the son of Jacob, which was the son of Isaac, which was the son of Abraham, which was the son of Pharaoh, which was the son of Nacor, which was the son of Saruch, which was the son of Rahu, which was the son of Philek, which was the son of Heber, which was the son of Selah, which was the son of Canaan, which was the son of Arthaxan, which was the son of Shem, which was the son of Noah, which was the son of Lamech, which was the son of Methuselah, which was the son of Enoch, which was the son of Jared, which was the son of Melilil, which was the son of Canaan, which was the son of Enos, which was the son of Seth, which was the son of Adam, which was the son of God. Wow. Mm. Mm. Wow. Jesus. This is the genealogy of Mary. What no accident he knew back in the Garden of Eden uh, who was
was going to be the one that was going to carry his son into the earth. Her genealogy, as with most women in the Bible, is highly disputed. But Luke, now hear me now, Luke talked to Mary personally. Who, who is your daddy, girl? And who is his daddy? Who is his daddy? And who is his daddy? Amen. And he wrote what she told him. Now history says that Heli, Heli, was Joseph's father-in-law, which was Mary's daddy. See, they don't do too much right. In the Bible, they don't talk about the women too much. In the genealogy. Every now and then you see one throw. You saw that in her. They, they, they throw one in there every now and then. But they didn't throw Mary's name in there. They put her daddy in there. Amen. Because you understand, whose house are you of? You a Ross? They, they, they see my daughter today. First they ask her, you a Ross? <laughs> they don't say, your name Damien. No, you a Ross girl. <laughs> don't know the child name, but they know. They look at her and tell her who her mom and daddy is. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you one of them Rosses, ain't you? Mm -hmm. See, I like to hear God. People look at you and say, oh, you one of them God children, ain't you? You look like God. You, you, you look like you could be one of them. You look like you, you look like you, you, you look you look like you could be one of them Christians. Yes, sir. <laughs> Christ like yes, ones. Yes, yes, yes. Amen. Amen. See, see, see now, now, now when we get into genealogies, like a lot of people are doing these days, you know, go on ancestry.com. Mm -hmm. Amen. We find out a lot about who we are. And where we come from. Amen. And this genealogy goes all the way back to Adam. Where God first called for the seed to come forth to destroy Satan's kingdom. Go to Genesis chapter 3. Amen. Genesis 3. Amen. And pick up at verse number 14. Amen. Y'all know I'm going to give you some glasses and leave me here, don't you? Amen. Put them up here with the water. <laughs> we haven't got glass on. I'm going to go to the eye doctor one of these days. Amen. These are real ones. They don't, they don't need no fixing. <laughs> <laughs> Hallelujah. Amen. Genesis 3 and 14. And, and, and he said, And the Lord God said unto what? The serpent. The who? Serpent. Who's God talking to? Serpent. Who was talking to for real? Satan. Satan. The Lord God said unto the serpent, who is Satan, or Lucifer, because what? Thou hast done this. Thou art what? Cursed. Above all the cattle and above every beast of the field, upon thy what? Belly, because snakes used to have feet. Amen. Amen. Oh, can you? Oh, my God. Jesus. <clears throat> can you imagine to be cursed and God take away your legs? Your ability to walk. Mr. Day you, you got to have a wheelchair. Because something you did. Wasn't no accident, wasn't no car wreck. Just what you, how you walked up and owned something, did something, said something, that God took away your ability to walk. Y'all hear me? Amen. 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 Jesus. <laughs> Upon thy belly thou shalt go, and thus shalt I eat all the days of thy life, and I will what? Put enmity between what? Thee and the woman, and between thy seed and her seed, it shall bruise thy head, and thou shalt bruise his heel. Now, the phrase, it shall bruise thy head, is coming, is the coming of Christ rising from the dead and defeating Satan. A strike to the head is deadly. Mm -hmm. yes, yes. 
This was not only God revealing the, the coming of Christ, but Satan's defeat. He is unveiling the plan of salvation to save the world through his son, Jesus Christ. And at this moment, he already knew that Mary was going to be the one. Because he said, what, the seed of what? The seed of who? The seed of the woman. Because the seed is, is normally where? In the man. The egg is in the woman. Y'all hear me? Y'all hear me? Yeah. The seed is most of the time with the man. The egg is in the woman. God has let us know right there in there. He going to do something miraculously different than ever been done in the earth. Mm. And we got to understand and see, see that, that we are God's child. We are God's seed. And God wants to do something miraculously through your life. Yeah. Amen. Amen. Go back to Luke 1. Luke 1. Verse number 26. And in the sixth month, the angel Gabriel was sent from God unto a city of Galilee named Nazareth to verge his spouse to a man whose name was Joseph of the house of David. And the virgin's name was Mary, and the angel came in unto her and said, Hail, thou art highly favored, and the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. Please hear God today. Gabriel appeared not only to Mary, but he showed up in, to Zacharias. He showed up to Daniel. And each time Gabriel showed up, he was bringing an important message Amen. from God. And Gabriel was telling Mary that she was highly favored by God. Not just favored, but what? Highly favored by God according to her lineage. Her family history. Because you got to understand, see, that there, 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 there's something down the line in your family. There's somewhere back where it caused you to be born today. There's something, see, 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 when we don't get with God, see, I don't know all what, what, what happened in my family, but I know somewhere down the line, they tell me as a preacher in my family. Somewhere up in up, up, up in the lineage, somewhere up in my great grandfather, brother, or something, something up in there. I don't know. Anybody told me? Amen. Hallelujah. You gotta understand, no, there's somewhere up in your life. There's something in there that calls God yeah. to have you to be born yeah. in this time, this day where you're living at right now in the name of Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. And see, we got to understand, see, see, see that when we get, in, we get into this, to this lineage of our family and the history of our families, right. amen, you got to understand and know that there's something in there that God put in the earth that caused you to be born for such a time as this. Yeah, amen. amen, 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 amen. And we got to understand that God uses our families. To be the vehicles that he gets us into the earth to get us into position uh, to bring his purposes into the earth. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Understand and know that, child. You got to understand and know that. See, 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 see that. You didn't get here by yourself. You didn't tell God, 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 I'm ready to go into the earth. Hallelujah. There was purpose in the earth and he called you and sent you into the earth. Purpose. And some of the most powerful people that God is using in the earth today didn't get here through husband and wife. Some was, was, was into the earth because of rape. Some was into the earth because of incest, abuse. Yeah, you hear me today? Everybody get it. Everybody get it because mom and daddy had sex, and now we here. No, Amen. You can't worry about how you got here. Amen. 
your job and then I find out why you got here. Amen. Why am I here, God? Yes, yes. What's my purpose, Lord God? Mm -hmm. You got to find out, please hear me, please hear me. And all you mothers that, that gave birth to them children, you got to find out which one of them one, if it's all of them, which one of them is it, God, that you place in the earth for your purpose? Amen. It's probably all of them. Amen. Amen. That's why he says what? Train up a child in the way he should go. And when he get what? He won't depart from you. Y'all hear me? Amen. I'm the joke is back there. That's, that's the main reason why I'm not going to rush this thing. Amen. They, build and build. they need to have their own area Amen. where they can learn about God's word. Amen. It ain't just about Mary had a little lamb. Or, Fleece was white as snow and everywhere they married and went. Y'all hear me? Amen. <laughs> Jack and Jill up the hill, pitching fell in water. Jack fell out. I ain't talking about all that. Amen. Glory to God. We talking about this little light of mine. Yeah. I'm gonna let it shine. Yeah. Everywhere I go, yeah. I'm at, at two years old. Yeah. 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 <laughs> This little, can you imagine? Two year old, this I will let it shine. Yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go in there and turn it out. Yeah. In the same box. Glory to all y'all, hear me? Over the juice box. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. Your two year old in daycare praying over his juice box. In the name of Jesus, oh God. Yeah. 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 Over the tea nuggets, oh God. <laughs> Other two year olds looking at him like, what's wrong with this fool? Do you want to pray, my brother? <laughs> hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Amen, 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 amen. See, see, God uses our families. Amen. amen. To get us into the earth. To get us into what position? Yes. To bring his purposes into the earth. Yes. And not many of us have been. Many, many of us have been through some tough stuff. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Rough situations oh, in our lives. But God, through his infinite wisdom and power, can take whatever you have, yeah. and whatever you have done, yeah. and whatever that you've been through. Y'all hear me? See, 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 see. Through, through, through man's eyes, you disqualify. Yeah. You come from the wrong family. Yeah. And born on the wrong side of the track. Uh, you the wrong color. You the wrong height. Uh, yeah. You have one eye going this way, another eye going that way. You, 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 you are disqualified. <laughs> come on now. There, there was a man in the Bible. Jesus had to touch twice himself. Yeah. He didn't want you to pay him. Can, can you see? Y'all see men like trees. Okay, let me let me let me, let me hit you again. Bam. Can you see? Oh yeah, I see clear. I can see clearly. <laughs> see, see, we gotta understand. See, all everything that man says disqualifies you. God uses as a qualifier. Oh my God! I've been counting out my whole life because of the way I was raised. Sit to Catholic school with bow ties and sweaters and stuff on, everything matching. And when we got, when we couldn't, my mama and daddy got divorced, we couldn't afford to go to Catholic school no more. We had to go to public school with them same bow ties and blue sweaters on. Get, we, we was getting beat up and stuff. Oh, to learn how to fight. Right. Yeah. Once you talk to them, when they was how to fight, then they might want to mess with us. So there's five of us. Yeah. And you fought one of us, you fight all of us. Yeah. Every time I seen you, I wanted to fight. <laughs> but I'm not fighting him. Y'all hear me? Amen. All right. Come on now. See, see, see. Situation. See, God sent you sent to Catholic school because see, you gotta understand. See, um, 85, 80, 85 percent of what a child learns the rest of his life, he learns between birth and five years old. Yeah. We was going to a good daycare center at, at the Catholic church. We had to read right early. Amen. Amen. Now I'm gonna tell you, like, I didn't get much learning after the, after the ninth grade, though. <laughs> Thank God I got it all before I was five. <laughs> Y'all hear me? Mm. Glory to God. Mm. See, and see, 
It's our families Amen. that God used to position us in for his purposes. Amen. And see, through God's infinite wisdom and power, he can take whatever you got. Whatever you have done. And whatever has been done to you. I'm talking to y'all this morning. Stop disqualifying yourself because of what somebody else done to you. That may have been the main thing God had to let happen you so he could qualify you. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Y'all don't hear me? Jesus. So no matter who you are, what you've done, or who did it to you, God has a plan. God got a plan. Get saved and make Jesus Christ Lord of your life. Line up your life with his words. See, we got to understand, see, it's a whole lot in here. Amen. He know you ain't going to get it all right. He know that, come on now, he don't expect you to get it all right. Amen. But he expects you to at least try. Yeah. Amen. 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 See, 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 come on now. Some of y'all afraid to cook Thanksgiving dinner. <laughs> at least try it. Amen. Amen. <laughs> I can't make greens like mama. Ain't nobody asked you to. <laughs> My pumpkin pie won't turn out. Try. How you know we ain't gonna put the pie in the oven? <laughs> you stood around watching all this time. Amen. Amen. Glory to God. You know, the kids will let you know. Oh, mama. <laughs> <laughs> Same thing with frying chicken. They'll let you know. Amen. Oh, ooh, mama, ooh, make yours next time, baby. Oh. <laughs> see, 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 we got, we got to stop disqualifying ourselves. God saw way back in the house history, he's going to make you rich. Amen. But you won't even go through the process of getting rich. Amen. It's hard to go from being, from being broke to being rich. Amen. That's a long divide. Yeah. He takes you from, from being broke to being where you can pay your bills. I ain't saying pay them on time. I ain't saying pay them on time now. Y'all hear what I'm talking about? Yeah. Yeah. Then get you to the place where you pay them on time. There you go. Then get you to the place where you can have some money left over. Yeah. Then get you to, to the place where you got plenty left over. Then that's the hard part. Right. Oh. What do you got to do with your surplus what he tells you to do with it? Amen. 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 Y'all hear me? Amen. He ain't saying you about no boat. Well, after honey, what you think? Do you think we need to buy a boat? I, I can't ask her. Because <laughs> she said, honey, with, with, with that sweet honey, <laughs> oh, Lord Jesus. <laughs> she never asked that nigga. <laughs> <laughs> What did God say? <laughs> <laughs> y'all know I already looked. Y'all know I already looked at the boat. Build him. Try to get a test drive. <laughs> <laughs> On the Ohio River. Got my skipper hat and everything. Oh, and he got the car. I ain't gonna bring it in the house. <laughs> <laughs> Hallelujah. Woo. What did God say? <laughs> anyway, God got a plan for your life. He got, y'all hear me? He got a plan. See, He ain't asked you what will happen to you. Amen. All He's saying is, come over here, I'm going to show you this thing right here. But Lord, you don't know I, I was raped. I was abused. I didn't ask you all that. I, I, I asked for your resume. Amen. I know your whole story. Right. I watched the whole thing go down. I need you to get over there, to over here, to over here, to over here, over here, and then bam, now we got you. Right. Okay. See, the problem with us is, see, the, when we get to the place where God is ready to use us, we, we, we don't want God. Oh, I called you, Lord, 10 years ago, God. 
<laughs> you didn't ask to be then, but I'm standing right here with you now, baby. Come on. What you need? Oh, no. well, okay. Uh, back around the mountain again. Amen. Y'all don't hear me. Amen. Mm. Then when we get halfway around the back of the mountain, we want God to come get us. No, you got to come back around. All the way around. Amen. Amen. See, that's our problem. We want God on our terms. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Amen. You got to come to God. You got to come when He calls you. You got to do what He tells you to do. Like He told Abraham get thee up and what? Get thee out. Get thee up and get gone. He, hey, hear me now. God said this, God, God told him, he said, get up and get to going what? To a place what? I'm going to show you. He's going to show you after you head out. We want to Google it first. <laughs> Where am I going, Lord? Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Uh, they give me the zip code, Lord. Because you know, sometimes you won't come up with the zip code in there, right? He didn't give me no zip code. He didn't give me no direction. He, he didn't tell him. He said, he said Abraham, uh, head north. No. Did he? No. He didn't say, he didn't say head south, Abraham. No. He still didn't say take lot with you. No, he didn't. <laughs> you know how we do? Well, you want to cruise somebody else in God's plane. I'm going to take my nephew with me. Okay. <laughs> Amen. We do the same thing today. Amen. Don't we? Amen. But what about her? What's he got to do with you? He asked you about her or him. Amen. He talking to you. Amen. Glory to God. Amen. And if they're living in your house, hear me now, if they're living in your house, that includes them anyway. Amen. 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 See, God has a plan for your life. Get saved. And make Jesus the Lord of your life. Line up your life with his word. And walk it out in your life. And God will redeem the time. Yeah. Yeah. Hear me. Don't think you missed it. God is outside of time. Yeah. He, he, he comes in out of time. In the way he can move your mistakes. In the front of you. So that you can run across the net. Because you're ready to handle it. Y'all forget me. And, and the blessing he gave you early that you messed it up because you was too young to handle it. Or mom and daddy didn't train you to take that movement around. Amen. Glory to God. Amen. Amen. God chose me. Amen. And he's chosen you. He's chosen me. And I had no clue to what he wanted with my life. Amen. To be standing here as, as an apostle and pastor is not what I had in mind. But he did. Amen. So being saved, and if you're not saved, get saved. See, salvation is this it's this whole big thing that God put into play that, that most of us don't fully agree with because we don't think we have to do all that to, to be part of this thing. You know, I ain't got to go to church. I ain't got to tithe. That's why, you, that's why you're dealing with the stuff you're dealing with. Because you refuse to, 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 to already come fully in to the qualifications of the blessings of God. See, we want to stand over here and tell God, well, God, I don't think I got to do that. But his word clearly says what, what you got to do. We got to line up with God's word. Amen. Amen. Some of us are just getting a sprinkle. I want a gully wash. Amen. Some of us are getting a thimble of blessing. And think you're doing something. You can look down the street and guy, some guy got a, 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 a tractor trailer pulled up full, full of blessings. You got to, come on. Amen. That's all I get, Lord. That's all you qualify for. Amen. Amen. Y'all hear me? Yeah. He's no respecter of persons. Amen. He is respecter of obedience. Amen. He respects your obedience. 
That's why some folk get more. See, some folk getting more than, than they actually qualify for. Amen. Because some of that, what they got belong to you. He ain't too short on his blessings. Amen. Amen. You, he said, I will supply what? Oh. All. Yeah. All mean what? All. Everything. Nothing missing. Amen. Nothing broken. Amen. Amen. So let's, come on, y'all. Let's, let's get a part and be a part of this chosen generation. Amen. We've been chosen. God chose Mary and God chose you. Amen. 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 Close your eyes. Now, I don't know who's in this room today that, that God is, is really, really dealing with. I know there's two or three of y'all guys really, really dealing with you because you, 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 you're starting to wake up now. You have been through so much, you lost so much, you done, you done, oh my God, you got to the end of your road and fell off over the edge and you hanging on by, the, by your pinky finger. Mm. And you know, one more mistake, one more act of disobedience. One more, I ain't gonna do it, Lord. And it may be the end of the land. I know, I know this ain't everybody, but it's somebody. Amen. You made some promises to God that you know that you was gonna change, but He's calling you on it today. Wow. He's calling you today. So if you're here today, you that person. Would you come this, this fine morning, this fine, fine, fine morning? Would you come? Don't sit there thinking about whether somebody see you or they don't see you. Who cares about all that? If it's you, would you come? Would you come? Don't be ashamed. Don't, don't, don't get look around. Hallelujah. God, God wants to use every one of you. Some of y'all sitting back there, hmm. I don't know, Lord. That's you still fidgeting around in your seat. Would you, would you come? Don't fidget. Come on. Don't fidget. Don't fidget. I ain't going to hurt you. I ain't going to put your business on out in the street. Just, just know that God, God is real. Hallelujah. He's real. I ain't talking to the two of you all that It's your child. It's your child. That you stand in the, that you come stand in the gap for. Because he'll use, he'll use you. Come on, because like I said, it's 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 it, it's our families. He he'll use. He he'll use you to get them into position. And you can't be afraid. To stand there and call on God for your child. Me and my wife just did it. And she don't know the full extent of what all it took place for her to be standing on the street after being in prison for 10 years. And you can't tell me that it don't work because it just happened. It just worked. For me and my family. I know what God will do. If you'll trust him. So I want you just to say, Father... Thank you, thank you for my life. For my life. I, thank I thank you for another chance for, another chance. for, me, for me and for my children. For my children. I, am I am your child. Your child. Give, me Give me specific, specific instructions, instructions on how I am to go forward from this day, from this day. forward. I need, I need your guidance. I don't need guesswork. I, need guesswork. I, need I need clarity on what to do, what to do. how to do it to do. Now. now. And Father, Father I, am I am obedient, obedient to your word. To your word. From, this day From this day forward, forward. I, will hear, I will hear and I will do. And I, will do. I, love I love you and I thank you. It's in Jesus' name. In Jesus name. I, pray. I pray. Amen. 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 Hug somebody. Hug somebody. Hug somebody. Hug somebody that you don't normally hug. Y'all hug each other all the time. Hug somebody else.
Amen. Hook somebody else. Amen. Get over and hook somebody else. Amen. God can redo this thing, y'all. He can redo this thing. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Praise your name. Praise your name, oh God. He's moving. He's moving in this place. He's moving in this place, oh God. He's moving in this place, oh God. Thank you, oh God. Thank you, oh God. All right, my brother. Hallelujah, God is good. God is good, God is good, God is good. Hallelujah. Hallelujah.